Please keep your caps on, those of you who are receiving Social Security. The shocking information that was just disclosed by Congress might put an additional $2,400 in your pocket. There is no doubt that you are going to be given a nice $2,000 plus change. Are you curious? You should actually be. It is not simply a matter of spare change either. It is possible that the matter that we are discussing will have an impact on the retirement plans of millions of individuals. In a few minutes, I will provide you with a comprehensive explanation of what this means for you, your family, and the future of Social Security in the United States. Stay there because I will explain. I can promise you that you won't want to miss up on this opportunity. You are all cordially invited to return to the channel. You should go to this channel in order to obtain the most up-to-date information on the various economic stimulus programs. There are some fascinating things that we would like to discuss with you today. Before we get into today's changes, make sure that you have hit the subscribe button and that you have turned on the notification bell. This will ensure that you never find yourself without an update on anything that is linked to stimulation. Even when things are difficult, we want to make sure that you are well informed and in charge. So let's get started right away, shall we please? We are going to go deeply into a topic that has the potential to impact the lives of millions of people in the United States. An additional $2,400 will be distributed to those who are receiving Social Security benefits. Let's start with the headline that has been the subject of the most significant amount of discussion. It is possible that Social Security claimants will receive an additional $2,400 as a result of a surprising statement that was just made by the United States Congress. To all of you, this is not merely a little adjustment. In this conversation, we are talking about a significant increase that has the potential to have a beneficial influence on the lives of more than 60 million people in the Union. Who will be affected and why is this a significant matter? At this very moment, you could be wondering, what is the precise audience that this pertains to? This information is particularly significant for the more than 60 million people in the United States who receive Social Security benefits. These are the Americans who have devoted their entire lives to the growth and prosperity of our nation, and they are the industrious individuals who have achieved this. Our parents, grandparents, neighbors, and other members of our community are the pillars upon which our communities are built. But this is the harsh reality of the situation. Several of these honorees are among the individuals of our community who struggle the most to defend themselves. They are the ones who have the most difficulty making ends meet on fixed incomes and are the ones who are hit the hardest by inflation during this time. There is a possibility that this raise which is being proposed could be the much needed lifeline for them. Those who are responsible for the plan, who then is deserving of our gratitude for this concept that has the ability to completely change the game? Let us use this opportunity to present Senator Elizabeth Warren, a progressive Democrat hailing from Massachusetts and Senator Bernie Sanders, an independent firebrand hailing from Vermont. It would appear that these two individuals who have been relentlessly advocating for the extension of Social Security may finally be beginning to see effects, not only a gain in revenue, but also the um, bigger picture. However, hold on to your hats because this endeavor is about more than just simply putting additional money into the pockets of individuals. It is the goal of these senators that by signing this law, they will be able to accomplish something truly remarkable. They will be able to extend Social Security until the end of the 21st century. We are, in fact, having a conversation about how to ensure that this vital program is passed down to subsequent generations. And that is not the conclusion of the narrative. Uh, furthermore, the measure proposes substantial changes to the monthly income that is received by all individuals who are beneficiaries of Social Security benefits. However, the benefits extend beyond the individuals who are currently receiving them. In addition, this is good news for those of us who are not currently receiving Social Security benefits, but who may in the years to come. The question has a value of $1 million. Is there a way to budget for it? I can appreciate what you are thinking at this moment, but how are we going to pay for all of this? Even though it sounds like a wonderful idea, things are about to take a turn for the very intriguing, my friends. The proposed legislation would impose a tax rate of 12.4% on the income from investments earned by those with high incomes. In this context, we are talking about individuals who have an annual income of $200,000 or more, as well as married couples who have a combined income of $250,000 or additional. The implementation of this new tax would not only assist to level on the playing field, but it would also ensure that those individuals who have benefited the most from our economy would contribute properly to this significantly essential program. Still, it is not the end of it. This legislation seeks to address a number of issues that have persisted for a long time with the current social security system, including the cap on the payroll tax. Incomes that are greater than $160,200 are exempt from paying the maximum social security payroll tax rate. This is the current situation. All income will be subject to the maximum payroll rate if this threshold is gradually increased to $25,000 by the year 2035, as the proposal suggests. It is a benefit for those who are the most defenseless. In addition to this, this is still another intriguing aspect of the concept, an increase to the special minimum benefit to 125% of the federal poverty threshold. This is something that is being considered. When expressed in actual terms, that is equivalent to $18,000 for a single individual who has worked throughout their entire lifespan. It is possible that this adjustment will be a game changer for individuals who have put in a lot of effort throughout their entire careers but still struggle to make ends meet once they reach retirement age. 
one of the potential outcomes is an increase of $2,400 on an annual basis. Let's return to the amount of $2,400 that was reported about in the media. The following is an estimate of the average yearly increase in Social Security benefits that could be brought about by this law, according to calculations provided by the Office of Senator Sanders. This is an additional $200 per month that millions of people in the United States might utilize to improve their food, their health care, or even just their mental wellness. There is an urgent need for action, friends, when it comes to the significance of this topic. I cannot stress it enough. According to a warning issued by the Congressional Budget Office, the Social Security Trust Fund might be depleted by the year 2033 if nothing is done to address the situation. It is possible that this would result in a terrible drop of 23% in benefits for all claimants. During this conversation, we are talking about a crisis that could take place within the next 10 years, on the other hand, here is the good news. By implementing this strategy, we have the chance to strengthen Social Security for future generations and avert the disaster that is currently occurring. The actions that are open to you are as follows. Consequently, what are some of the things that you may do to help bring this idea to fruition? Staying informed is the most important thing you can do. Please share this information with the people you care about. The greater the number of individuals who are aware of the problems at hand, the more pressure we will be able to increase on our elected officials to take action. In the second place, make your point clear. Call, write or send an email to on your delegates to communicate with them. You should let them know that you are in favor of increasing and improving Social Security. Always keep in mind that you are employing them. In conclusion, carry on with the discussion. Have a conversation about this issue with members of your community. Whenever there is a greater amount of discussion about it, it becomes increasingly harder for politicians to ignore it. Friends, this is a defining moment in time. During the next several months and for many years to come, the decisions that are made in Washington could have an effect on the financial stability of millions of people in the United States. The plan to enhance social security payments and provide recipients with an additional $2,400 is not only a change in policy, rather, it is a strategy to increase the benefits. The statement is a proclamation of the kind of society that we intend to establish. A community that shows concern for senior citizens and works to ensure that they are able to live with dignity. A culture that recognizes and appreciates the contributions made by individuals who have been with the company for a long time. A culture that encourages the establishment of a solid social safety net for all individuals. We have reached the conclusion of the video for today. We'll catch up with each other in the upcoming video. Um, if you find this video to be enjoyable, please consider subscribing to the channel so that you can watch further films in the future.